Beauty for ashes. Lay down to sleep, but as eyes shut, the blink of blue flashes sirens at you. Behind eyelids that rest and wrestle to shut it out, to stop the day that you left behind, as you stuffed the suit and gloves into the sack in the back of your car and drove drove away, but behind the image stored up, the wrinkled skin, the laboured breath, the numbers you wrote down to decide, is this life or death? To stay at home, you left, a soldier bereft. Bereft of clarity, certainty, proximity, a virus unknown, your invisible enemy. Words now your sword, ears keenly pricked, as you carefully tread the fine line to prevent the dead. Saunter slow in the race. There can be no rush. PPE to put on. Mask tied. Check. Speak slow. Reassure. Time ticks. Talks. Ticks. You drove away. Leave the day behind. But the words in the telephone come back to haunt. Daunt. Did you do enough? Hands tied, blind, this is your life entered in overnight. A mission transformed, the world in this fight. Static but stoic, a country in hiding, together but scattered, community shattered. Pockets of normal in sunny backyards, children play hopscotch, find sticks, stones, watch eggs hatch. Spring unfolds in slow motion unmoved by the plight of our nation on pause. Pause. We clap, we paint rainbows, flown high from the windows of flats, homes, offices, gateposts and schools. Our flagship of promise, hope, closure, completion. A beauty revealed only after the storm.